Let's go, guys. Let's go, dude. We can, we can do this. Today will be the day where Pandemonius drops the big trinket. Relic, totem, whatever it's called. Guys, don't attack into the thing. You guys know the deal. We've done this so many times at this point. Yeah, don't, don't, uh... Okay, here it is, guys. My name is Guzu TV, and this is how I got totem of the astral winds. Why am I even trying, man? It doesn't want to drop, guys. I'm very sorry. It, uh... Not today. What's the drop chance? I I don't know, actually. The drop chance is... I mean, there's one, two, three, four, five, six. There's six items. So the drop chance sh should be uh, 20%, right? Technically. Un un unless, like, uh, unless it has, like, a different drop, dro drop table than the other one. If I keep running it every single day, at some point it will drop. There is simply 0% chance that it will not. Okay? And I have the persistency, I have the consistency, and I have the... I, I can do it. Like, I can just do it. Dude, we got beat by the goddamn Feral. And we did the same damage. So we, we it's a shared first place, okay? Tomorrow for sure. Yeah, <laughs> tomorrow for sure, right? As the smart individual I am, guys, I'm gonna say, okay, I'm gonna do this quest after. And I'm gonna do this one right here. I'm gonna be doing the Horn of... This is the quest chain I talked about with that huge... Uh, you gotta go to Ironforge, then go to Lakmodan, then go back to Ironforge, then go back to Lakmodan, and you get, like, a bunch of XP, right? So we'll do that now. We have to solo, like, a big elite, though. Should be fine. I don't even think I have to kite this guy. I, I think uh, Carl is probably strong enough to, uh, to do it without. Also, frick. Oh my god. Oh no, my bow skill is so low. But, okay, let me just get Serpent Sting rank 1 and we'll spam that. Okay? Yeah, we'll just spam Serpent Sting rank 1. The thing is, my pet is so strong that it can straight up to solo it. I remember back in my day. Back in my, the heyday of me playing Classic WoW Hardcore. If you guys remember that. This, this mob was actually difficult AF. Okay? This was such a hurdle to get over. And like now I'm, I'm literally sitting here on a hunter spamming rank one serpents thing and I can kill it with my pet, right? It's so OP, man. I, it's actually broken. Yeah, sometimes you skip levels. If, if you spam like a skill, you, you skip levels sometimes. Let me just stun him as well and then we can do it. What a solo. That's the horn. Markle's horn. That's the one we want. So this brings us to Mountaineer Pebble Biddy. This is just the first quest, by the way. It's gonna, We're going to give a lot more XP. That right there was 14k, just from the first turn in, and there's three more turn ins. There's one in Ironforge, and then there's one back here. We will literally almost ding just from this. Does this one give 10k as well? What can I do for you? What the? <laughs> what the? <laughs> Hello? That, that right there, guys, that we just did was 25,000 XP. Just from that right there. And we have another, we have a final turn in. And then, we, that, and then we're gonna go into uh, Siren Gorge. Yeah. Okay, what do we get for the final one here? Are we gonna ding? Surely not, right? See you soon. Oh my God, that's still a lot of XP, though. <laughs> I think... Where were we? We were, like, here, right? We got, like, six bars from that. That's crazy. I know a lot of people have been complaining about the gun sound. So now we're actually finally a, a real hunter with a bow. So that's good. Actually, we do do damage. No, we, we actually do do some damage with the bow already. Even though it's not... It's... The bow skill is 178, and it's already doing damage. Maybe it's because they're low level. Hey. All right, we got it done, guys. Level 50. Here it is. Boop. Nice. And we're gonna bring that quest to Ironforge. Awesome, level 50, guys. Okay, let's go over and kill the last geologists and then we can do all the quests here. Okay, why? These, uh, this, like, camp is so buggy. The mobs are like resetting and stuff like that. It's really weird. Yeah, that, that place right there, that, that little box is like a reset spot for some reason. Hello! Here you go. Uh, this quest, we're not gonna do that. That This quest is like, uh, it's it's a long one. It, it's, it's, it's not worth it. It's just not worth it. Okay, let's go pick up all the quests. What the flip? You know what? I think this guy might need it. I'm not gonna attack that. Do you need it? Do you want that? Uh, let's go to the town. Oh my god, there's so many quests here, guys. <laughs> there's so many quests here. Oh god, look at all the quests, dude. Oh gosh, there's too many quests. You know what a lot of quests means, though? It means a lot of XP. What do we got? Hawk? Okay, it's actually very smart we went back. We got Hawk and new web to strike. And a Growl as well. Okay, that's actually big nice. New Hawk, new Raptor Strike. We also got a new Serpent's thing. And a new Volley, which is the greatest ability of all time, obviously. You know, Volley is insane. Yeah, Volley is really, really good. So I'm really happy I got a new Volley. It's fantastic. Yeah, boys, now we can actually finally start the questing in uh, Siren Gorge. 
Yeah, now we got everything picked up, so now we can start it. Well, actually, the most objectively smart way of going about these quests in the Gorge of the Searing is actually by doing the spider quests first, because they are located at the perimeters of the zone, and henceforth, we can get the spiders whilst also getting some of the golems and collecting Heart of Flames and the golem oil. So the most efficient way of beginning this zone is by doing the spiders and the golems and the outside perimeter of the zone first. Okay, so that's what we're going to be doing. All right, because the flawless flame also, um, the reason why we're also doing this first because is the flawless flame leads into a quest where you got to get a bunch of daggers from these mobs, right? And that way you can get the daggers and the, t the opportunity quest and also get the fiery flux and also get the other ones the spy class and the, the, the thing you know we are e extreme min maxing this guys this is this is unethical gameplay no we'll see i think guys we're gonna be when we're done with this zone i think we're gonna be level 52 okay yoink Ooh, 10k baby 10k just for that this is unethical Okay, we need 15 more of these. I think the worst the worst quest is probably the one with the golems, man. That's the one that takes the most time, at least. Any quest in this chat? Uh, here you go. Mm, very nice. Yeah, and this is the dagger quest. Okay, so now we got that one. That's good. Let's finish the spider one, though. Okay, now we got... Okay, so the spider quest is done now. So now we just need to... We need to get the golems, and then we need to kill a bunch of dwarves. Yeah, we need to clean this area out. Since we got the spiders done. Oh, we got the spyglass! Nice! Okay, so now we can go up here, and then we can start getting the um, the smithing terraria. Yo, drop it! I lost! It dropped. Okay, it dropped. Finally it dropped. God, that took forever. That took so long. Oh my gosh. Okay, so now we just need some taskmasters. We need three taskmasters. They should be right over here, right? Surely. Okay, look at all these quests. Look at all these quests we got now. Woo! We're gonna go turn them in. Oi, oi, oi. Will we ding? Find out in the next episode of Guzu Ball C. Or right now, if you keep watching. Then we'll see how it goes. Forging the shaft. Ooh, nice. Hello? Ooh, okay, another one? Oh, how about a... Wait, hold on, we need to repair. Let me just turn this on. Okay, one more, one more, one more. Two more. Oh! With you. <laughs> that is so are you kidding me man <laughs> no shot no <laughs> shot okay you know what let's go you know what how we're gonna think guys it's gonna be really easy it's actually it's a very simple conundrum all we need to do is we need to go kill one of these elite mobs over here they're gonna henceforth drop the symbol of black and rose on their first attempt and then we will get it yeah. My name is Goose of TV, and this is how I got Symbol of Ragnaros first try. God damn it. You know, if you don't get it first try, you're just gonna get a second try, right? That's a lot of drops, but not the one we wanted. Holy cow! What the hell? I was like, what the flip? Do you guys remember? You probably do. Remember me struggling killing these on my rogue, where I literally have to like gouge kite back and forth for like five minutes just to kill one mob? And here, I'm literally just sending in Carl. And AFK. And this is that easy. God, it's ridiculous, man. How strong are hunters, man? It's almost unfair when you think about it, right? <laughs> it's so stupid. Okay, well, it's just that easy. Third mob. Literally third mob. Okay, we're done. Let's go turn it in. Here it is. Woo! Okay, level 51, guys. 51, baby! Let's go! Actual gaming today! Look at that, what a great start, eh? We're already almost two bars into 51. And now we're gonna listen to this guy talk, I think, right? Be patient, Kasu. The torch is almost complete. I am- okay. Also, guys, remember what we said about this guy. He's literally a dragon. Okay, we're helping him... His, his line is, vengeance shall be mine. Literally a dragon. 
and we are assisting him in performing evil deeds in the world. It's very bad. See you around. Let's keep doing it. Yeah, let's keep doing it. Might as well. You know what? We're doing it. Oh, another 9k? Holy macaroni. Okay, let's go get the um the, the things. We gotta light up some towers, guys. Yeah, just like uh, Lady Prestor in uh, Stormwind. She's Onyxia, right? It's the same thing. Yeah, it's the same thing as Lady Prestor in, uh, in Stormwind. Actually being Onyxia. And also Fiona in Shrek. She's an ogre, right? And also, you guys know in uh, Finding Nemo, where they actually find Nemo in the end, right? It's the same thing as that, right? It's it's like, we gotta realize some things aren't as they seem, right? You know, also Boromir dies in Lord of the Rings. But we all know that, because we've, we've all seen it. Let me just do this here. And then we're gonna do this. Easy clap. All right. Uh, okay, let's turn this in, guys. We got another one. Dude, this is the easiest quest in the world. <laughs> I for you know it has to go wrong when you just when you talk about it right like it it, it 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 that's just how these things work whenever you mention something going smooth it's just bound to go bad it, <laughs> it's just the nature of how it goes it is glorious is it not glorious master it is indeed glorious See you around. uh can i turn it in though hey there. there it is what? What? 19k. I'm already at the at the mint pit. Jesus. What? Okay, you guys couldn't see it, but he turned into a dragon. Uh, you know the thing I spoiled for you guys like a few seconds, like a few minutes ago. Uh, yeah, he turned into a dragon, but we just couldn't see it because it bugged out. So, yeah, it is what it is. You can you didn't get to see it. Sorry. Wait, hold on. Wait, block job. Wait, no, no. Wait, wait, wait. Wait. Listen, listen. I have another job for you. If we succeed, you get 10 gold. I will be kiting the boss. You gotta take care of mobs around me. Okay? Just... If, if I'm running into a mob, it's your duty just to take them off me, okay? This is technically a solo. Bloke job is his helping with the surroundings. Okay, I am soloing the boss itself. All right, so it's fine. Uh, maybe. Oh, frick. Uh, the guards. Okay, the guards. Wait. Okay, this is really bad, actually. Okay, blow up. You handle the guards. Blow up. You take care of the guards. Okay, it's still a solo. I'm just doing only the boss. It. This is technically still a solo. Okay, because I'm, I'm, I'm just doing the frick. This is technically a solo, guys. Okay. You know you know why this is still a solo, guys? Because bloke job is a part of the guild. And as a guild, we stand together. Okay. That's that's all there is to it. We step. Uh, he's polymorphing me. He's going to kill Carl. This B-word is gonna kill Carl. Don't you don't touch the boss. If you touch the boss, I'm disqualified. This is technically still a solo. This is still a solo, technically. Okay, you, you gotta look at the, the analytics and the statistics, okay? This is still a solo. Because here's the thing. What I would have done in normal circumstances is I would have. Cleared those mob prior, and then went on the boss, okay? The only thing that's different here is that uh, Bloke Job made it faster for me to clear those mobs, right? And now we do the solo. So that's it, man. This guy does a lot of damage, by the way. Can I slow him? <laughs> you see that, guys? I used my... Uh, Oh god. My big brain. Ah! 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 God, I wish I had Carl with me right now.
Wait. Hold on. Oh, this is really bad. You can kill him. No block jump. You could just go gonna kill him, man. It's alright. You can kill him. I no, it's fine. Just kill him. It's 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 fine. Just kill him. It's okay, man. No, you, you can you can go ahead and do. It. Frick! Wait, invite. Wait, hold on. Listen, man. In my defense, um, he regens his mana very fast, and there's very there's a very limited space to solo him on. So I actually think this counts as a solo. Okay, technically, right? Because there's very limited space, you know. Don't die, bloke job, by the way. Don't please don't die, sir. Oh. <laughs> that that gnome just did a drive by. <laughs> the, the mage literally fi finished him off. <laughs> yeah, we <laughs> Easy. Easy, guys. Thank you for the help, bloke. Job. Appreciate that. Thank you, man. Hell Overseer right. Malturius. Ooh, that's a tight... Uh, that's actually really good. Ah, this one is nice too, though, and it's, it's male. But mine is kind of... That's a lot of agi, though. Uh, I'm gonna go with this one. Boop. Watch, get her back. God. Okay. And this one too. You got my attention. Big oh, we got Lufa. And then this one. Talk to me. Walk with you. Nice, dude. Almost 52, guys. You cannot tell me at this point that we're not making progress. We are leveling so hecking fast.